Hey guys, welcome if you're new. My name is Irma. So today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you this filing cabinet that is just so practical and very helpful for um, your office or for your homeschooling, for kids supplies and all of that. I am quickly going to go ahead and open it. This video is sponsored by Yuta Home. So thank you so much for sponsoring today's video. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, I love that their products always arrive in great condition. I've never had any problems or anything with this company. I have so many of their items um, in our home that we just love so much. And I just love sharing them with you guys. Um, is the, but yeah, I am here quickly just going to go ahead and start taking out all of the pieces. So as you can tell, this did come with a bunch of pieces. I'm not going to lie. It took me quite a little while to... Uh, put it all together but what i really like is that they have all of their items or pieces lab labeled and the manual is always so helpful so here i'm just going ahead and taking out where the screws are at um, and getting just a little quick look at what the manual is and how everything is supposed to be looking before i really really deeply um, dive in so like i mentioned they always have their stuff labeled either with letters or with numbers which is very helpful so thank you get the home for um, going ahead and doing that for us um, the buyers who have to go ahead and build the stuff up like I mentioned it is a filing cabinet and it is on wheels so very easy and practical to move around from place to place um, and see here is where I'm showing you all how all of the screws are um, with their either letters or numbers in this case most of them with were with letters they always have the tools for you guys um it came with this really cute is the handy um screwdriver but i ended up going ahead and using the drill here it shows you all of the pieces and numbers and letters of everything you're going to need see here for this board it's number four and then even these metal parts had certain letters on them to help um help you let I'll let you know which ones you are going to be using. Those were the CR and these actually are labeled as CL. Um, so I guess it is very important for you guys to go ahead and check everything out before you try and start putting everything together. Like I mentioned, I am going to go ahead and use the drill. As you can tell here, I started off with the screwdriver that came in hand um, in the package. But in case you guys don't have like a power tool or something, you guys could go ahead and use that. I wanted to go ahead and do it the faster way. Plus, I love using my husband's um, tools and everything. So I quickly speeded up this process um, with just using the grill. And I'm doing it for both of these sides. So I'm pretty much just going to go ahead and speed my way through. Here I showed you guys a new piece, which is the letter B that I'm going to be using to apply to this little board. Um, I do share close-ups of pieces and bits of what um, tools I'm using and how am I applying them and everything just to make it a little bit more helpful and easier for whoever is going to be purchasing this and putting it together like I mentioned I did it did take me a couple of hours um, to put it all together uh, I had already expected it because there's a ton of pieces plus I'm a very handy person as well so I did not struggle as much and like I mentioned the um, manual is always so so helpful which I really really appreciate from this company because they have the things written out um, so easily for us to go ahead and install or build uh, their items so it's a very big plus for me especially for somebody who is not very handy I know you guys are going to really really appreciate this but yeah we're going to go ahead and continue putting this filing cabinet together. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to share when I style it because we're actually in a little bit of a makeover remodeling getting planned to do um, in our closet. And that's where I want to go ahead and make the room to go ahead and add this to that spot as well. Um, but I will share with you guys all of the way everything looks when it's all finished and completed. Here we're quickly just fixing and working on the top part. So you can tell it does come with dowels as well besides all the screws and all the other accessories that it needs. Once again, it is very easy to put together. Just took me a little time, especially for being the first time ever doing this. And well, what would you expect right from a piece that has so many little pieces to it that needs so many screws? But I really like the way it turned out. It is just so nice and very helpful 
Um, so yeah, we're going to go ahead and continue building this filing cabinet. If you guys are interested in purchasing one of these, go ahead and check out my description box. I will have everything linked, including their discount code that they get for me to share with you guys. So you guys go go ahead and get your hands on one of those. Um, I already slide in the back part of the cabinet. So here I'm just placing what would be the bottom part um, with some dowels and screws as well before we could go ahead and add in the little wheels, which I just love that it's on wheels because it's easier to drag in and out of a place um, without scratching your floors and so on, especially since you could use it like in a office or if you want to go ahead and just um, organize like kids supplies um, like their papers and all of that this would work just perfectly fine then this was something new to me I've never actually seen like these little pieces but it was really cool um so these pieces you actually place them here like the thin part kind of slides into the wood and it's to kind of keep that board which is the backing in place so it doesn't move um this whole thing was the like the whole filing cabinet was a very he heavy piece so it's you know it's going to be a very good product a very heavy duty um style um but yeah i really am excited for being able to organize all of our paperwork bills all of that junk that you know it could just pile up um in the closet or in a box or something so i'm excited to go ahead and get all of that organized and looking nice and more easier to access and be able to um, easily put stuff back in and just keep it all organized um even when i put the door um hinges on this was super easy as well um and then well like i mentioned it is like a very durable product which i am so thankful for the door actually um locks on with a magnet so you know it's closed securely and the drawers where the drawers were very easily to slide in and slide out as well so i'm going to go ahead and quickly screw on this um, metal piece for the magnetic part and here i'm sharing with you guys how it is looking i still need to put each individually drawer together but look at how good the suction or the magnet it is um, by closing it it is a bit dusty so i do have to wipe that down um it's not scratched or anything like i mentioned their product always comes very in very good and nice condition here i'm just going to be sharing with you guys how i'm going to go ahead and quickly put just one of the drawers together it is a five drawer um, cabinet filer and so I didn't want to go ahead and board you guys with the long process of putting all five of these together, which would be just a repeated process. But here you guys seen I just grabbed what be, would be the front part and I screwed in these longer screws. And I'm going to use these and put them on the side screws and this is going to help them stand and connect to the sideboards before we could go ahead and put in the backing. The backing part is actually a little bit more thinner type of wood. But it's something that will still hold up a lot of weight. So don't worry or be afraid if it's going to break or collapse easily. Because trust me, I do not think it will due to the type of um, quality that the product is. And here I'm just going to go ahead and quickly apply what is the back part of the drawer. Then we're going to use these longer screws to go ahead and screw it all in to get it um, to be into that box shape. Before we could go ahead and start applying the metal parts that you guys saw in the beginning of the video that were labeled CR and CL, which are actually the little wheel parts that are going to help for this um, drawer to easily slide in and out of the cabinet. I thought I was going to struggle to put these drawers together, but it actually was very easy as well. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this video. If you Once again, if you guys want to get your hands on one of these filing cabinets, which with school starting, um, it is so helpful to organize all of the kids' school supplies and everything. Go ahead and check out the description box. As you can see here, the drawers easily slide in so smoothly, which I think is just so great. Um, and, and I will be sharing all of the measurements a little bit towards the end for you guys. If you guys are wondering the height, the width, and the length. Um, so yeah, I always like to share the measurements with, with you guys in case you guys are looking for a certain uh, area to put this um, at. But once again, go ahead and check out the description box. Uh, thank you so much, Yeet the Home, for sponsoring today's video. I hope you guys have an amazing day. 
and i'll see you all in the next one bye